Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Factorio here on the Wooden Otter. Today I'm going to be uh, correcting a mistake that I made a few videos back where I said I was working on blue research and then I did not do any such thing. That's right, today we're going to actually be working on blue research. Uh, it should be fairly simple actually and uh, we'll see what else we get into along the way. Thanks for joining me and let's get right into it. What do we want to happen here? We wanted to dump onto the inside of the belt. Yeah, then I can have sulfur on that belt too. Sweet. Here it comes. Chugga chugga choo choo. So we'll have sulfur engines and red chips right here. So that means I want one, two, three. Four high six. <laughs> we'll just we'll just do them all. Why not? So here's what I want. I'd have to do it starting here, basically. If I said blue research, sulfur, red, and engines. So red can be in like this. Sulfur and engines. Well, okay, so if I want... I'm gonna want a few more uh, red chips, basically. I'm gonna want, like, well, a bunch more, frankly. So... Yeah, red chips and blue research are gonna be competing for space here. But that's okay. All I really have to do is, like, drop it down one and it'll be perfectly in line. Yeah, so what needs to happen is like, if we did one, two, three, four, we'll just say five more. So this is where I want the belts to start moving. Click, click, turn down. One. We can extend the red a little bit. So we could, in theory, end up with one more. Yeah. And then we can extend the engines. Do I need plastics all the way over here? I guess I don't. Right? Like, I could... What are plastics used for? Plastics are used for this. So I could, in theory... Take this out. Do a filter inserter just for sulfur. Alright, let's get some power lines, because I need that. For now, we're just going to do that. And we'll do... That. So that thing's going to get chips. I need... An armature to give it... Sulfur. And an armature to give it engines. I need to... Do an armature here that just passes engines. Engines! Where are engines? Motors. Right here. Do that. This here. And connect. And then pick all these things up. Because what has to happen is I have to use the output 
Like you were working on trains, I believe. Oh, did you? Yeah, but I'm about to transfer it to an outbound uh, network. How do I want to do this? I want to get it over to here. Ah, Samsonite. No, pretty much. Yep. You don't remember? Uh, of course ah, I do. Samsonite. I was way off. <laughs> of course I do. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh, uh, what do I want to do? do? Check. Oh, I have to. I have to run a different belt. So, all right. Now I got a way for. Blue research to get down here. Click, there it goes. Alright, I gotta make more engine machines and more, uh, what's it called? Blue research machines. We'll do two, three blue research machines, and we'll do. Uh, two, three, four. <laughs> what is this? Uh, three in, one out on the bottom. So we'll do one out on the bottom. Two in, one in, 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 in. Did you ever watch X Machina? No, I didn't. <gasps> oh my gosh, are you serious? <laughs> I'm not joking. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm, I'm serious. I never got around to watching it. Can we, go, can we watch it, dude? It's like one of those movies that, like, I watched it like two years ago, and, and I'm like, I still think about it, like, on the reg. On the reg. I'm not joking. That it was intense. I well, I've I've read about it, so I know it's intense. But yeah, You've man, read sure, about we can, it. Really? We can watch it someday. You read about it. Yeah, listen, I know that's a weird statement. I'm not gonna lie to you. But, like, yeah, dude, I read about movies a lot when I don't uh, get to watch them. Or when I don't get around to watching them. Yeah, it is a weird statement. Yeah, it's not. Sorry. Red in. Red out. Red is in. Stupid. Yellow in. There it goes. Research. Blue research. Oh shoot. Ouch. Baboon. How do you see what the production levels are again? Uh, is P. Uh, and then you can go. Yeah. yeah. Um, it's also in the upper right under the like the little uh, heartbeat symbol. And then I usually go to ten minutes. Gives you a good number. And if you want to isolate, you can click any of the resources. Like if I go to plates right now, and iron plates, we're making 544 and consuming 553, so we're in the negative with iron plate production. Yeah. We're good on red chips. We're falling behind on green chips, but that's okay for now. Uh... Black research. Or 
we not are we not producing any black research? Is that why it's not even on here? Um I mean clearly we are. No, we're not. Oh, we might we're just not, we're not just... getting any grenades. And the reason for that is that we're not getting any iron plates because they're all getting sucked up by steel production. Well, I did just empty the bin. Well, so. Like I said, steel production is a pro or iron plate production is going to be a problem. If I said that this had to be copper plates, yes, yeah, he's going to try and put. You it got in the same too much spot. red ammo. Can we just you turn red ammo down to one? Like, why you got three red ammos? Now nah, we we have to, dude, because we're firing the turrets all the time. I'm stealing all the red ammo then. That's that. I need to find a way. Man, we're not even making this now. What did we short on here? Making what now? Coils. Red circuits are slow. Yeah, we're slow on coils. Which is saying a lot. Because... Why are we slow on coils? We're churning out coils, but I could put down two more coil machines. No, they're where are what they going? What is using coils so much? I mean, as they come up, they just keep coming up. They come up. It never gets split. It gets split. Uh, where? Here. This armature is pulling them off. Yeah, but that's like what's slow. Yeah, it's weird. Yeah, it's literally because the red chips use so many of them. So I just gotta build more coil machines. Here's what you should do. Really. You you have iron plates here, so you should have another long red arm feed iron plates into it like this. Okay. Okay. So like every every furnace should be pulling from both sides like this. You don't need the first ones. The first ones always yeah. get it. Yeah. Alright, All right. so, so the first do that. four eat off of one belt. The second four eat off of the other one. So now I should get, uh... should get a lot more steel. Occasionally I will get steel, it will come this way, it'll go there, where's that go to? There, building there, coils, there. wasn't I? And then I'll run it off this line, that's fine. Okay. Oop. And then we got... Belt. Uh, well, not that one. Belt. And we'll do inserter and inserter. Copper coil. Copper coil. Alright, I got uh, two more coil machines going. Production. Coils. Coils. 10 minutes. 2.2, 2.1. Alright, so we're good on coils apparently for now. We're good on this. And we're good on research and we got plenty of friggin motors that's for sure man blue research is gonna eat red chips I kind of want to do more red chip machines just like down the line I think I'll do that three of those please thank y'all red chip This one, and it's 
red in, red out, blue in. So, red in, blue in, red out. Here we go. All right, now production. Ten minutes. That's almost even. There we go. All right, it's positive. All right, what am I doing now? I don't know. What are you doing? I got, I got blue research good. I got red chips good. What do I want to make next? You want to do lasers? Yes. Because that would be kind of cool. Or we could do robot count and weapon shooting speed. But lasers is fun. Um. So, like, for instance, like this, like, I needed to get water here for this stuff, and it's like. It's crazy. And it's only crazy because I need to route water somewhere. You know? No, I get it. That just does it's... not work, does it? I will now make it a complete mess to the point where you are annoyed. <laughs> Pretty much! How do and I then you'll be like, why did I invite you? And I'll be like, well, it's and that was the last time we had a guest. Like, to give you an example, like, we need coal, in sulfur, which and water in one place, and it's all here. But the problem is, well, it's like, how do you load in you back coal, sulfur, and water you into put them these on two machines? Row. Unless I take... Well, I just... these two. Up north of me. Yeah, well, listen, you move the water up one, basically. But then I gotta run the water and the coal and the sulfur. All right. Where the hell is it? It's fine. Let's do it. Uh, is it a chemical plant? Is that what I'm doing? Go put those machines where you want them. All right. Where the hell is it? Uh, is it a chemical plant? Is that what I'm doing? Yes. yes. Okay. You don't. You Cold. can take those things that I don't do the other one Pull sulfur and water. Yeah, so you're going to have to go up here, you can pull sulfur, then you're going to need an arm to throw sulfur onto it. You can pull coal from the left. Sulfur's got to get diverted here and, and sent north. And then Why? Sort of, you just said we're going to start it on another row. Well, I mean, can't we fit it here? That's what I was doing. Yeah, this, so if you need, like... But this is the plastics row. Like, if you're going to keep it in Yeah, rows, but we're not going to need more than, like, two or three things of plastics, right? I don't know. Well, here's the problem, though. You don't have water here, so you're going to... Like, you, if you want to keep it simple, here you have petroleum gas. So the only... It would make sense to put... Like, down here you have sulfuric acid. There's no point in putting something that needs water here. You put something that needs petroleum gas here. And down here, you're going to put stuff that needs sulfuric acid. So if you want water, just bring it up and start another row. Yeah. Which means no, you're right. you grab your sulfur with a selector arm, run it here and over. And then grab your coal and run it over. And then I'm going to go grab water right here and run it to you. Sulfur. All right. Well, let's think about the spacing real quick. There's your then. water line. Here's your water line. Well, hold on. Let's let's think about the spacing we want for a second. So we want the output for this is going to be a solid, right? Uh. What is it? Yeah. Yeah. So. 
we can basically put it on the same belt as sulfur. So that means all we really need is water. There's coal. You're, what? You're putting that at an arbitrary height. Yeah, the, I mean, the other coal one's at an arbitrary yeah. height. Well, it's not really, because it's, it's height exactly over to the plastics thing. Lasers are done. I'm going to do uh, laser turrets. We can put it anywhere you want. I just drop the chemical plant. There. And yes, I want it in that orientation. Okay, so you want water to run down? I want water to run like right here. Just north of these power poles. And then I want sulfur. I missed it by one. Why don't we put two? Oh yeah, I've got I've got two. Uh, oh, right no. next to each other. You do? Oh, you're gonna. Well, how are you gonna feed them both? Well, because they're gonna get fed off of the belt to the north. And then where's their output gonna go? Their output can go. Um. Oh, here you know what? Watch this. this. The space. I'll, I'll show you. I'll show you how it's done. I'll go work on something else. Well, you don't want to watch my genius? No. Oh, you're lost, man. We can do this. We can do... Do we'll do purple, maybe just coal, and then we'll do oh, steel is so slow. There, coal will now be on the opposite side of the belt. So everything will get fed from this side. And the output... What are these going to be? Explosives? Yeah. Yep. Yep. And the output can be just a normal thing. Click, click. And a belt. Oh Eating my belt. god, I want it. Oh, I want it. Oh, you silly man. Oh man, I want that. That's so cool. I screwed this up. Yeah. So close, though. Alright, let's get that. How do I... I need to run... What do we have the most of? Do we have light oil, heavy oil? Or we never did that? We never did that. We have to research the advanced... Uh, what's it called? Alright, I need oil. Again. Which means I'm gonna have to run a line like 400 yards freaking north. Might as well make uh, 300 of those pipes. All right, explosives are on the belt, I'm getting produced. Actually, oil comes in down here. Maybe I can go left. Wow, well, you really know how to aggravate the enemy, don't you? I don't know what you're talking about. Apparently not. What happened? You <laughs> like, you're off by one and you just left it. <laughs> I was right? like, oh god. What are you talking about? <laughs> Nothing, I fixed it.
flamethrower turret. Should we build flamethrower turrets? I just built some. I'm trying to get them plumb. It sucks. Oh, you have to plumb them? Like they get a pipe? Yeah. So, you're not going to like my design. Um, <laughs> God, you say that every time and you're always correct. Well, Why I'm running the wheel all the way around the base. Because if we're going to run flamethrower right. turret. Well, that's easy to make a logical design, though. You just, like, route it next to or one away from the, uh, the ammo belt or something. You know what I mean? Oh, you got a belt, an ammo belt up. Awesome. Hopefully it's up to snuff. It is. You did a good job. Congratulations. You're not a complete waste of space. There, I've crippled all our production. Yay! It's my pleasure to annoy your game. Um, You're really good at it, not gonna lie. Is Next time, on the Wooden Otter. Oh wait, is that is that what we're supposed to do? Yeah, why not? So. Next time on the Wooden Otter, we uh, I join make the game at the same time. <laughs> I make spaghetti out of all the conveyor belts, and Bob fixes all my work. Oh, God. Thanks for joining us <laughs> here at the Wooden Otter. Peace! <laughs>